The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Usos from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds. Main event, Jay Uso! A member of the famed Otawaii family, here comes Jay Uso. Michael, it really is unbelievable that one family can produce so many top stars. He has a big match ahead of him. Going to need a career-making performance here tonight. Imperium has arrived. A united group with one unwavering mission to prove that the match is sacred. And his opponent, representing Imperium from South Tyrol, Italy, weighing in at 220 pounds, Giovanni Vinci! Gunther Vinci Kaiser. They have taken all of WWE by storm. Yeah, Gunther, the longest reigning NXT UK champion ever, has also held the Intercontinental title. Vinci and Kaiser, multiple-time NXT Tag Team Champions. And guys, we're only seeing the beginning of their dominance. We are moments away from seeing Imperium's mission statement in action. And that's unfortunate for anyone else in the ring. When it comes to in-ring competitors, Giovanni Vinci is just about as polished and intimidating as they come. He's an impeccable physical specimen with a very serious attitude. The only thing more impressive than Vinci's raw power is how deftly he controls it. He lands hammering blows with expert precision. He's not someone to be taken lightly to between the ropes. Yeah, a well-rounded competitor who has all the physical ability you could ask for and the callous will to put it to devastating use. And he's got Jay Uso to deal with, who really hasn't been the same since Roman Reigns beat the humanity out of him. No, he's been better. Jay walks different. He talks different. He's more aggressive. He even carries himself like a main eventer, which is what he is. Main event, Jay Uso. Hurricane Rana. Not to state the obvious, but if you want to win against Jay Uso, you need to keep him grounded and not allow him to hit any aerial attacks. So here's some free advice for his opponent. Wear Jay down. Pile on the attack so it becomes too hard for him to climb those ropes. That's good advice, Corey. We both know that if Jay can get to that top rope, he'll be that much closer to earning the win. And Vinci is keeping the match at his pace. Smart strategy, trying to wear Jay down and keeping him from climbing the ropes. Looks like he has his finger on the trigger now. Oh, well, look out. DDT with diving delivery. Amazing. Kick out. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Up for the electric chair. Deck for the win. And only gets a one count. Somehow still in this fight. Not down and out yet. Boom! Gets out of there in a hurry. Back into the ring. Strong display from main event. Oh! Taking it right to him. No waiting. Uh-oh. Yeah. 
and able to counter. A well-timed dodge. Nice rolling fire that's there. Section 112. Oof, ruthless striking. Hit drop. I've been waiting to see that. Kick right to the body. Jay taking his offense to the top rope. Top rope. Uso with the Uso splash. Will Jay take advantage? Shoulders down. So, picking up the win. Here is your winner, 